All right, I'm here with starting libero Natalia Skiba. And Natalia, after that game yesterday, just how important was it was it to come out here at home and get this win? That was just like our number one goal, coming out strong with a lot of energy. Really important. And then you had 21 digs as well. Just talk about how important it is to get that first pass to the center and how important that defensive presence is. Defense in the women's game is very crucial, I think. As long as we all work together, getting that ball up, blocking, we're in really good shape. And this is the start to CAA play. You guys are off to a good start. I mean, just how are you going to take what you got here in this weekend and carry it throughout the rest of the season? I just think just working together, um, starting off strong, and serve, serve, receive is very important. And I think we did better today. You had a lot of players contribute off the bench, a lot of new faces in today's game. And how important is that team-wide, everyone contributing in their own roles, important to the game? Uh, it just shows that teamwork is really the most important thing and that um, every aspect, it just shows the other team like something new. I'm Zolan Kano Youngs, and I'm here with Coach Ken Nichols. Coach, great win today. And, and it seems like in each of these games, we always see a new person coming off the bench and contributing in their own way. Can you just talk about the depth of your team and really just how much of a part of your, co uh, your coaching strategy that is? Mm, I don't know about strategy, but um, uh, it is fun to have the depth. We've, we've come a long way as a program. We've got a lot of great support. Peter's done tremendous things for us. And, you know, uh, the football team notwithstanding, uh, that was a tough time um, here at Northeastern, but we've benefited as many programs have. And so now with um, this extra talent on the bench, it's, it's fun and it's rewarding and it keeps pressure on everybody. Um, but I, I think the most important thing is we, we've got a good healthy balance. People appreciate that somebody else can come in and play. Uh, a lot of the times the players are telling their replacement, you go in for me kind of thing. And um, um, it does make it a little bit of a challenge. You know, it's, um, I got a few extra chess pieces to, to move around, um, but uh, that's not something to complain about. No, it's not. And you talk about Brianna Hollis. She came in and really added a lot of energy to the game, a lot of hustle. Can you just talk about her play today? Well, I, we've talked about this um, in weeks past. We've seen uh, Alexa come in and do it. We've seen um, a, a number of players, but Bree can always be counted on to sort of change the dynamic in the match. Um, she should have seen some time yesterday, uh, and I, I get some regrets about that. But um, she got in there today. And she showed um, the rest of the team what we were trying to do with the game plan in terms of how to get the ball into the splits, where, where she was serving, uh, making good reads on defense, and really taking charge. And so um, she sets the bar pretty high when it comes to getting off the bench and having an impact. Now, UNCW was really in there for the first two sets, and then the third set, you guys just really came away from it. What was so different about that last one? Uh, I, I think, you know, in particular that first rotation, uh, we were talking about this just a few minutes ago, is sometimes it's just how you match up. Not, it's, it's so unlike basketball in that you know, when the guy's playing basketball, your matchups are what they are. You know, who you've got out there, you can go after weakness, you can exploit a strength. But in volleyball, we have rotations. And so it really depends on who's in the front line, who's serving, who's passing. And I think uh, we, we'd moved the rotation a little bit, and we got a really good matchup with Ina as a good spot server uh, against a rotation that she could really take advantage of. And, um, and then a few others really stepped up and, and served tough, and I think that set the tone. But this is a, a, a much improved UNC Wilmington team. Um, they, they've always played us hard. There are years where, you know, honestly, they struggled a little bit in conference, but they came in here and pushed us to five. Um, so we expected a really tough match, but they're, they're going to be there at the end. All right. Thank you so much, Coach, and good luck throughout the season.